I remember I got my first pap smear when I was like 17 or something. They told me like, hey, like we just processed your results and you have some weird cells. They said, can you please come in for a biopsy? Which is basically when they take a sample of those weird cells and that's how they test for cancer. And I was freaking out. I was 17. I'm like, what the hell? They did the biopsy, whatever. And they said, yeah, they're weird cells, but they don't seem dangerous. You should just come in for a checkup every few months. And I kept going to the doctor every six months to get these pap smears. And it's like a metal thing with like a little brush at the end. And they literally stick it up your vagina. And they like kind of like fluff it around in there. And then they like take it out. Like, they just like put stuff in you. And it's just like the most uncomfortable thing for me. Like I ended up changing my OBGYN because I changed health insurance. And then this new lady was like, oh my God, whoever did a pap smear on you before you turned 21. And I'm 20 now. So I've basically been going for like three years. They're like, I would idiot. A lot of the time when you do these pap smear tests and these biopsies, they end up being like false positives just because your body's continuously growing. Stop doing these until you're 21. We'll just do like a swab test, kind of like a Q-tip and then go in there with it. That's for like just making sure you don't have any STDs and you're all clean.